What's up guys, Astrax here. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys another short video. Today I'm going to show you guys on how to make the top 4 best easy casual tryhard male outfits. So the outfit that I'm wearing right here will be the first outfit I'm going to show you guys how to make. But the outfits on the thumbnail are going to be the other outfits I'm going to show you how to make. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get into the outfits. When you do get to a clothing store, you're just going to want to head over here to your tops. When you do get to your tops, go ahead and scroll down until you do find sweaters which is right here on slot 39. So go ahead and click on sweaters and you're gonna be looking for the black turtleneck, which will be right here on slot 69. So just go and equip the black turtleneck. After you did equip the black turtleneck, go ahead and back up over the tops and just head over here to your pants. Whenever you get to the pants, scroll down to fitted suit pants, which is on slot 12 and click on fitted suit pants. And you're gonna be looking for the black skinny suit pants, which will be on slot 35 all the way at the bottom. After you did equip those pants, you can now back out and head over here to the accessories. When you do get to the accessories, scroll down to gloves, go ahead and click on gloves, and look for the black woolen gloves, which is on slot 58, and just go ahead and equip those gloves on your character. After you have your accessories, and now for the other top, for the suit jacket, you're now just going to want to head to the diamond casino for this. When you do get to the casino, you're just going to want to head over here to your tops. And whenever you do get to your tops in the casino, just click on fitted suit jackets, which is on slot one and look for the black pocket jacket, which is on slot 37 and the fitted suit jacket will look like this. And I'm pretty sure it will cost around 14,000 chips. So if you guys don't have that much, just go ahead and go up to the front counter in the casino, buy chips, and then you should be able to buy it and equip it on your character. And now, after you did equip the fitted suit jacket, you can now back out. And to finish this outfit, you will just want to go ahead and head to the mask store. Once you do get to the mask store, just walk over here to the mask. Once you are here, scroll down to ski mask, which is on slot 19. And buy the black tight ski, which is all the way on slot 114. After you did equip the black tight ski, back out of the mask. Walk over here to the hats, which is on the left side. And scroll down to tribbles which is on slot eight and click on tribbles and you're going to be looking for the black bowler hat which is on slot 51 and it'll look like this hat right here and after that that's pretty much that's pretty much it for this outfit so now you can just go ahead save this outfit on whichever slot that you guys want either at the clothing store or right here at the mask store and now that you do have your outfit we can now just work on the second outfit this will be the second outfit I'm going to show you how to make. So for this outfit, just head over here to your tops again. Whenever you get to your tops, scroll down until you do find designer hoodies, which will be right here on slot 37. So just click on designer hoodies and you're going to be looking for the graffiti black guffy hoodie, which is on slot 13. And after you do have the hoodie, you can now back out of the designer hoodies and scroll down to slot 53. And you're gonna be uh, you're gonna be clicking on utility vest, which is on slot 53, and you're gonna be looking for the red camo plate carrier, which is on slot 38. And now after you do have the hoodie and you guys have the utility vest, you can now back out of the tops and head over here to your pants. Whenever you get to the pants, scroll down to leather pants, which is gonna be on slot 11, and you're gonna want to go ahead and buy the black leather low crotch jeans which will be right here on slot four. Once you have the pants, you can back out of the pants and walk over here to the accessories. For the accessories, just scroll down to gloves, click on gloves, and buy the red and gray armored, which is on slot five. Once you did buy your gloves, back out of the accessories, head over here to the shoes, scroll down to sneakers, which is on slot two, and look for the crimson high top sneakers, which is right here on slot 17. Once you do have the crimson high tops, you can now back out of the shoes, head over here to the hats, scroll down to caps forward, which is on slot four, and you're gonna wanna go ahead and buy the red bigness cap, which is on slot 42. And after you do have the red, the red bigness cap, you can now back out of the hats, and we're now just gonna go ahead and head to the glasses. And whenever you do get to the glasses, just scroll down to sports glasses, click on sports glasses, and you're going to want to go ahead and buy the red or the ox blood outlaw goggles which is on slot 12. after you did buy the goggles you can now back out of the glasses and now you're just going to want to head to the mask store for this outfit when you do get to the mask store you're just going to want to walk over here to the mask go ahead and scroll down to ski mask which is on slot 19 
and go ahead and buy the black and red tight ski which is on slot 39 after you did equip that mask your i'm pretty sure your goggles and your hat will come off so now you're just going to want to go ahead and just i would head to your apartment so then you guys don't have to run back to the to the mask store or clothing store because if you guys uh do the telescope glitch and if you guys get on a vehicle or get inside of a car you guys uh the hoodie will come off your character so i just recommend that you guys just do this telescope glitch at your apartment after you do get to your apartment, you're just going to want to head to the telescope and just do the telescope glitch. So go ahead and run past the telescope, hit right on the D-pad. You guys will see that your character's mask does come off. Go ahead and pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to accessories, and scroll through your glasses until you do find the Ox Blood Outlaw goggles. After you do find the goggles, you can just walk away from the telescope and you should see that the mask does combine with the goggles. And now you're just going to want to go into the telescope glitch again. And whenever you do the telescope glitch, pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to accessories, and scroll through your hats until you do find the red bigness cap. Once you do find the red bigness cap, you can go and walk away from the telescope, and you should see that the mask, goggles, and hat do combine all together. And now after you do have that, you can back out of the accessories and scroll down to your hood, and it'll say down, just hit right on the d-pad once and then you guys can put it up on your character just like this and after your outfit looks just like this you can now just go ahead go to your closet and just edit say and go to your edit saved outfits and just save this outfit on whichever slot that you guys want and after you did save your outfit that's pretty much it for this outfit so now we can just go ahead and work on the third outfit once you are back at the clothing store, this is going to be the third outfit I'm going to show you how to make. For this outfit, head over here to your tops. Whenever you do get to your tops, go ahead and scroll down to designer hoodies. And whenever you do find designer hoodies, which is on slot 37, click on designer hoodies. And you're going to be looking for the baby blue SN hoodie, which is on slot 5. After you did buy the baby blue SN hoodie, you can now back out of the designer hoodies. And scroll down to slot 53 and click on utility vest. After you did click on utility vest, look for the ice plate carrier, which is on slot 50, and go ahead and equip that utility vest on your character. After you do have your utility vest and your hoodie, you can back up the tops and head over here to your pants. When you do get to your pants, go ahead and scroll down to leather pants, which is on slot 11, and look for the white leather low crotch pants, which is on slot 8. Once you do have your pants, back up the pants section and just walk over here to the accessories. After you get to the accessories, scroll down to gloves, just click on gloves, and look for the blue surgical gloves, which is on slot 52. And now, after you do have the blue surgical gloves, back out of the accessories, walk over here to the hats, scroll down to arena war shoes, which is on slot 14, and buy or equip the white and blue light ups, which are on slot 48. And now that you do have the shoes, you can now back out, head over here to the hats, Scroll down to caps forward, which is on slot four, and make sure you guys do have the Enus Yeti forwards cap, which is on slot four. And after you do have this cap, you can now back out, and we're gonna go ahead and just head to the mask store for this outfit. When you are here at the mask store, walk over here to the mask, go ahead and scroll down to the black claves, which is on slot three, and you're going to want to go ahead and buy the blue stripe knit black clave, which is on slot 46. So after you do buy the black clave, you can go ahead and back out of the mask. And we're now just going to go ahead and head to our apartment so we can do the telescope glitch. After you do get to your apartment, you should only be wearing this mask that I'm wearing right here. And after you do get to your apartment, you're going to want to head to your telescope and just do the telescope glitch. So go ahead and run. Hit right on the d-pad you'll see that your character glitches where his mask does come off go ahead and pull up your interaction menu scroll down to style scroll down to accessories and scroll through your hats until you do find the blue yeti cap whenever you find the anus yeti forwards cap you can just walk away from the telescope and you should see that the mask does combine with your hat and now after your mask and hat do combine pull up your interaction menu Scroll down to style, scroll down to the bottom until you find hood, and it'll say down, and just hit right on the d-pad once, and you guys can set it to up, just like this. And after you are done, that's basically it for this outfit. So now you can just go ahead, go down to your closet area, 
and you can go to your edit saved outfits and save this outfit on whichever slot that you guys want. And after that, that's pretty much it. So now we're just gonna go ahead and work on the fourth outfit. So for the final outfit, you guys will just wanna go ahead and head to the Diamond Casino for this outfit so we can get the top first. Whenever you do get to the Diamond Casino, you guys will need 9,000 chips for this top that I'm wearing right here. After you do get 9,000 chips, head over here to your tops, go ahead and scroll down until you do find overcoats, which is right here on slot five. Just go ahead and click on overcoats and you're gonna be buying the gray Blagirius Parka, which is on slot five and just go and equip that hoodie. After you do equip that hoodie, you can now back out of the tops. And now for this outfit, you guys will wanna go ahead and head to a clothing store. I recommend to go to a clothing store that's near the strip club so then we can just do the rest of the outfit over there. Whenever you do get to the clothing store, you're just gonna wanna head over here to the pants. Whenever you do get to the pants, go ahead and scroll down to sports pants, which is on slot five, and you're gonna be looking for the charcoal low crotch pants, which is on slot 40. So after you do equip those pants, you can now back out of the pants, head over here to the shoes, scroll down to sneakers, which is on slot two, and you're gonna be looking for the white plain high tops, which is on slot four. So after you did equip the white plain high tops, you can now back out of the shoes, head over here to the accessories, and for the accessories, just scroll down to gloves, click on gloves, and look for the black woolen gloves, which are on slot 58. And whenever you do have the black woolen gloves, you can now back out. And for the mask, I'm gonna go ahead and just take that off, and so I can show you guys later on how to do it. So after your, after your outfit does look like this, you guys will just wanna head, head up to the front counter, save this outfit on whichever slot that you guys want. After you did save the outfit, you can now go ahead and back out. Scroll down to your, uh, scroll down until you do find heist coveralls, which is on slot 13. And for, scroll down to, uh, from slot nine through slot 12, and just select one of these outfits that does have the toxic mask. So after you did equip one of those outfits, you're now just gonna wanna head to your CEO building or your apartment so we can do the telescope glitch. Whenever you do get to your CEO building or your apartment, you're gonna wanna head to the telescope and just do the telescope glitch. You're gonna wanna go and run past the telescope, hit right on the D-pad, and whenever you did hit the glitch, the mask will come off your character. So just pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to your outfits, and go ahead and select the outfit you just saved at the clothing store. After you did save the, or after you did select that outfit, you can now walk away from the telescope and you should see that the mask does combine with your outfit. And after your mask did combine with your outfit, you're just gonna wanna go ahead, go into your closet area and just save this outfit again on any slot, it doesn't matter. But after you do save this outfit, you can now go ahead and back out and you're gonna wanna just go back to the clothing store. When you do get back to the clothing store, one thing I did forget to say is make sure you do put on your hoodie whenever you are wearing this toxic mask. So just pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to hood, and make sure it is set to up. And whenever it is set to up, you guys can now go ahead and go up to the front counter and save this outfit on whichever slot that you guys want. After you did save the outfit, you can now back out to the clothing section, scroll down to flight suits, which is on slot nine, Scroll down to black flight suit, which is on slot two, and just go ahead and equip the black flight suit on your character. This is optional. If you guys don't want the black flight tube, you guys don't have to do this glitch. But if you guys do want the black flight tube, then after you do, after you are wearing it, you guys will just want to head to the strip club for the glitch. Once you are here, just head up to the door, and whenever you are in through the door, you guys will see on the flight tube, or on the flight suit outfit, the flight tube will come off your character. So just pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to your outfits, and go ahead and select the outfit you just saved. And so the toxic mask won't be on your outfit after you do select the outfit, so go ahead and select the outfit twice. And after you do select, after you do select it again, you guys will see that the mask does come on your character. So now you can just walk out of the front or you can walk out of the door and whenever you do walk out of the door you will see that the flight tube does transfer over to your outfit and now for the final thing is the parachute so for the parachute just pull up your interaction menu scroll down to style scroll down to parachute and make sure the bag is set to the black combat shoe bag and for your parachute just make sure it is set to on and if you guys don't have the black combat shoe bag 
you guys will just want to go ahead, head to the gun store, go up to the front counter, go to parachute, go to parachute bags, and just buy the black combat shoe bag. And just like I said on how to put it on, just do the way I told you, pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to parachute, and make sure it's set to on, and it should already be set to the black combat shoe bag. And that's pretty much it. So now you can just go ahead, go back to the clothing store, and you can just save this outfit on whichever slot that you guys want. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys did enjoy these four casual outfits. I hope you guys did enjoy. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.